Come in. Oh, if you're here, that must mean it is. Oh, midday already. Jeez, time does fly, doesn't it? Well, I'd hate that for our special time together to be interrupted. Come, you know where you belong. <laughs> so indigent. We've been spending time together for, what, nearly a month? Here, let me scratch that pretty little chin of yours, yeah? You like that, don't you? <laughs> oh, look at you. Oh, he's so cute. Making those cute noises. <laughs> there you go, burying your face in my chest. To protect that. Sensitive little neck. <laughs> Fine, I'll let you rest in quiet while I read. Hmm? What am I reading? Oh, just some tomes on necromancy. Nothing special. <laughs> I have to keep the ghosts as an act of... Servants here, somewhat happy. Don't I? <laughs> Don't worry, before you get upset. There's more than happy. They are more than happy to help out. Well, I'd, provided I protect them from the ravenous demons that want to drag them to hell for their crimes. Isn't that quaint? Oh, you'd like to read too? Ah, of course, you come from the wild. I am sure you haven't had much access to human tools. Especially books. Very well. I'm more than happy to teach you. Your company has been pleasant, even though you do make me so very hungry. <laughs> Whatever I will do. <laughs> Whatever will I do if I run out of food, my dear. <laughs> hmm? Oh, the part of my face, um, a few inches beneath my nose. That is chitin, dear. Chitin and protein of sorts. My body is a mix of it. Humanoid flesh, and I suppose from my chin down, it also makes up my mandibles. I'm sure you've noticed. Why do you sudden interest in my anatomy? <laughs> Scritching under my chin. <laughs> oh, my lips are right here. There. You might not have noticed, but... I try to not open my mouth, and if I can help it. Most of you sweet, silky little creatures just have the most awful panic attacks when I do. You'd want to see it. Well, very well, but I'm going to wrap most of my arms around you and use the last two to hold your face in place. Alright? <laughs> Heaven knows I wouldn't want to scare my puffy little darling. <laughs> yes, my tongue. The first about seven inches when I yawn fully. Very useful for probing into stubborn flesh that doesn't want to come free. No. Uh, <laughs> my nice pointed teeth. You want to try your luck. <laughs> Don't get your hand too close on. 
Oh, don't look too upset. Honey, it's just the reflex. Okay, I didn't mean to snap my jaw at you. If I were to bury my face into that sweet little neck, it'd be a miracle if I didn't bite. But you want to test that theory, do you? <laughs> I'm a fan of experimentation, so... <laughs> and your reflexes are desperately flapping to be free. <laughs> Hold still, love. It's important. To keep still for the experiments is dangerous as this one, okay? Spiders, or even driders, wouldn't use their mandibles to taste, no. Consider, like, your standard jaw, yes? One doesn't use their jaws to taste. They use them to hold prey in place and perhaps tear the flesh. But I can taste via mine if I really want to. And you have the cutest taste of pollen and fear. <laughs> I really hate how nice that feels. Being docile just feels oh so wrong when it's making me sleepy. You know, it's I think it's been two years since I slept. Come with me. If you will. And stop staring at my tongue, dear. It's not poisoned, okay? <clears throat> uh, uh, do you think I'm really gonna let you go? You're still injured. And now you have to be punished for trying to tame me. Since this is your fault, you will be taking responsibility for it. No? Yeah? <laughs> well, here we are. My gardens. They're beautiful, aren't they? They're somewhat in... despair. Before you arrived, but... I thought it might put you at ease to have a little safe space before you explore. For, <laughs> for me to potentially hunt you. Mm-hmm. I'll set you down. Feel free to explore while I settle in. You have... <laughs> you got ten minutes to return to me. <laughs> Good, you came back right on time. Here, lie down with me. Look at you, already so obedient and so trusting. Even though you lie here with that little scowl on your face, you know, I think you're the first that's even seen me open my mouth and didn't scream. And the way you breathed, when my lips were inches from your neck. <laughs> well, act indigenous if, if you wish. But we both know you will not be able to pretend forever. <laughs> there you go, honey. Curl right on up. I hope you have a pleasant dream. My soft little... My love. <laughs> Or that your nightmares about me. Whichever. Nightmares are good dreams. Just make 
picture you dream of me.